uh, we like to make everybody feel that we're listening to what their problems are. So we want to act like a big sticky spider web and we want to catch them, we want to bounce them off to where they need to go. We want them to have excellent outcomes and they know they can get that from us. I think the growth that we've um, that we've found over the last couple of years is really just a byproduct of the the many systems and the many um, initiatives that we've sort of taken on board. Um, we seem to sort of adopt most things, um, and then if they don't entirely suit us, we will evolve them into something that works at this pharmacy with our team. We have a cadetship program at uni, and they need mentoring, so part of my role is helping them monitor what they're doing and actually showing them ways to be patient-focused at work. Um, it's not just all about checking scripts, but it's, you know, how do you know where someone's taking their blood pressure medication they've been compliant? The only way you can check is to take their blood pressure, measure it, record it, um, and they're simple things that you can do in pharmacy um, and do well. We've got a fairly elderly community here at Redcliffe and one of my priorities is to make sure that if I'm ever called upon to actually give a detailed medication history, I can actually deliver that medication history with complete accuracy but um, interpreted in such a way that I can give that in a concise manner. Well, we consider ourselves to be the future of what pharmacy should be rather than spiralling things down a, a price driven path. We think there's a lot more to pharmacy and you know, we feel that pharmacy undersells itself. So you know, we're, we're trying to get the word out there that you know, this is where the most accessible health professionals there is. So because we actually have a very, very friendly team and we actually want to know them and we actually want them to know us, we actually add a, add a, add a service to every single product and you'll always get served by a pharmacist in this store. We want to tailor the experience that they have for each individual person that comes in. Um, regardless if they're picking up medication or they're just seeking advice on um, some vitamins, we want to make them feel important and we want them to um, trust us enough um, to take our recommendations as well. We think patients come to Peak Pharmacy because there's a community feel. The staff know the patients, the patients get to know the staff. They feel more comfortable and therefore they're more open in their interactions. We provide a range of professional services to our community. We found that there was a, a niche missing in our community for foot care for the elderly. So we trained up a nurse who now has a separate room with a leather recliner and our elderly people love it. Um, Broken Hill has one of the highest um, uh, obesity levels, the poorest um, health um, you know, in, in Australia. Um, we've, uh, I guess we've developed lots of um, very important um, links with uh, local organisations and local um, healthcare groups. Um, we see that as an important way of, of allowing us to um, help the community. Yeah.